Hey, hey guys, how y'all doing today? It's your girl Bree Dupree. Um, as you can see, we have different backgrounds going on. So I know I've been lacking on the uploading, but it's because I recently moved to the suburbs and I have some video footage that's um this will be to the center that's pre-recorded, but I've just been lazy with um editing them and uploading them because I am working two jobs. So your girl is barely has time to do anything so oh hello highlight how are you doing today <laughs> um anyway so i am currently living with my sister until i move to my apartment next month so we're just gonna have to deal with what we got but let's get into why you guys are here um you guys seem to really enjoy my try on hauls that's like the most viewed thing on my channel that and how to boil your wig which is like the first video i ever made which people are really really hypercritical of and it's just like chill out bro it's like one of my first videos I ever made um so i decided let's go ahead and do another try on haul so today we are doing oh forever 21 and i literally have a bag inside of a bag here um uh, they had a sale i went on two different occasions so it's like a collective haul um and if i if i try to find i'll try to find some things online but i went into the store um both times as you can clearly see from the bag so if it's not online uh try the stores but most of my things i got was on clearance because they were having a the first time i went it was buy one get one free it was half off the first it was like half off the clearance price and then buy one free buy one get one free so you get like half off of one thing and then the other thing is lesser value you get it for free so I couldn't pass that up and then the second time I went it was like uh, half off of clearance so um, I went on two different occasions one was really around the holidays because I was trying to find a New Year's Eve outfit so eh, kind of late <laughs> and the other one I just went to like a week or two ago so one fairly recent and one not we're gonna get into the we're gonna get into the one that i got on the holidays first and then we're gonna go to the one that's fairly recent now with forever 21 i recommend if you're in stores to always try on their clothes because forever 21 doesn't only carry one brand it's different brands and their sizings are kind of a little bit all over the place kind of i'm typically a standard 18 but i have gotten a pair of pants on them before that are 16s and some 18s on me i just don't work um i'm normally a 2x but i do have some things in here that are 3x's so i would just say for me try on the clothes forever the actual forever 21 brand i'm like a size 18 in but they do they have started carrying other brands there so yes let's get into the first bag i'm just gonna dump them so you guys don't have to hear that crinkly sound because i know it's like super obnoxious so the first time I went, like I said, I was looking for New Year's Eve things. So it's a lot of skirts and dresses. I typically don't buy a lot of shirts from Forever 21. For some reason, they just don't speak to me. Or I don't think the price is comparable to um, the usage for it. But a lot of these things I still have the tag on, so I will let you guys know. However, do we, just keep in mind that it was like buy one, get one free. So I, if you calculate it all, like I got stuff for free too. So I'm not going to like try to figure out what I got for free or not and I don't think I kept the receipt yeah I didn't keep the receipt so we're just gonna go with the flow so the first thing I got was this black skirt and it has these details here at the bottom I'm not typically a skirt person um uh, but I did try this on and I liked it and I thought let's try something new I bought this because it's like a velvety suede material I'm not sure if you can see that but you can tell that's matte um, I am in front of natural lighting right now. So you can tell that it's matte. And I thought it would be cool for the fall time, which is now over. Um, well, or for the winter time, because I bought it on winter time. To wear, like, what, to wear with like some tights and boots. But um, I mean, I'm pretty sure we can find a way to, to transfer this into the springtime. And then it just has the zipper. This is actually the back. So it has a gold zipper in the back. And then this is actually how the front looks. So this was this was originally twenty two twenty two dollars and I got it for five dollars and this is in a size two X and it's called skirt slash slash short black but there's no shorts in here so I don't know what's up with that but it fits pretty well it hides your little pudge uh, it goes right above the knee and I like it very much. 
So moving on to the next thing, I guess we'll, we'll just stay on the trend of skirts. I got this next skirt, which really also isn't me, but it is a little bit longer. And I was thinking, you know, this could also be office appropriate or like dinner appropriate, family appropriate type thing because a lot of my clothes are like clubbing going out clothes. So it's just a regular elastic -y, um skirt, has a lot of stretch. So I will say if you're a 3X, you can probably fit in this as well. Um, it was originally $12.90 and I got it for $5. And it's, I mean, this is also the Forever 21 brand. I got it in a 2X. And it just has a lot of stretch. So if you're one of those girls who has a lot of hips and a lot of butt, which I don't have either of those things, um, I don't think you'll have an issue with getting this online or or even sizing down if you want a tighter fit. I think for me it fit it fit pretty 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 good. But if you're like one of those girls who like skin tight things, you can definitely definitely size down in that. And then I got a lot more other things in there. I got this dress because like I said, I was looking for a New Year's Eve dress to wear. So I decided, let me just try this dress. I didn't want black for New Year's Eve. I wanted to do glittery and I wanted to be funky and fun, even though this isn't glittery. And it's this like bodycon dress. Um, I do recommend wearing Shaper with this because you'll see in the try on portion. And all along the side, it has like this crisscross detail. But here's the tricky part when you want to wear if you want to wear anything under here is that it's actually sheer right here so if you're going to wear shapewear i recommend wearing nude um and then it also zips in the back it does have some stretch to it um it is kind of a thicker material like here in the front so it is like that bodycon sort of suck you in type situation this is in the size 2x i don't have the price on it because i actually wore this dress um like around the house or whatever but i know it was fairly cheap so there is that i also got this skirt oh my god you guys this skirt um it's like a skirt short situation i'll i'll let you guys know what happened um, the tag isn't on this one either, so I know it was cheap though. So it's a really, really long skirt. Again, you guys will be able to see better in the try-on portion, and it has this fairly high um, slit, which it like the tie stops right here. But I'm pretty sure if you wanted to, you could tie it. You could tie it along further because they all have um, these holes in them, or you know. So I'm pretty sure you can like monitor how high of a slit you want it to be but what's so different about this skirt is on the inside of the skirt there's like it's hard for you guys it's hard to show you guys there's like this short it has like a short sewn into the skirt um and here is like the material for you guys to see but uh here it is see like the little underwear and stuff i mean you guys i'll show you guys in the try on portion and you'll probably be able to like get it and understand but it does have like a short situation which a you could appreciate but b for me not really because i mean i typically wear shorts underneath my skirts and dresses anyways to prevent chub rub but these shorts it's kind of like a high-waisted underwear so it's not like a longer thicker short where your thighs won't rub together i'm pretty sure your thighs will still rub together so just keep that in mind with this and i also got from there this skirt this dress i mean and this dress was like 12 dollars. i don't have tag on it because i've worn this dress plenty of times um wash it plenty of times but this is actually my favorite favorite thing i got from there so and this is like the last thing i need to get one more thing for the buy one get one free because i got um one two three four actually there was something else i got i can't find it though um i need to get one more thing so i ended up just getting this this dress last minute i didn't try it on and i got it in 3x because when it's on clearance you really can't if you like it i mean you just have to there's not like they have it in stock and you can like choose your size. Do you know what I mean? So I got it in 3X and I was like, oh, it might be too big, but it was kind of cute. And I just absolutely love this dress. Every time I've worn this dress a couple times, I get compliments on it all the time. You can see here, it sort of divs in. So it gives you sort of a flared out situation. It's a little tied here. There's a little, it's a little bit of a lining. I don't know if you guys can see that right here. There's a little bit of a lining where it kind of sucks you in on top and then releases at the bottom type of thing. So it does give me sort of a hip because my hips do dip in. They don't go out, they go in. Um, and it fits me perfectly. This is a little bit off the shoulder 
here and it's elastic right here so it's not going to slip up and slip up and slip down it's, it's elastic and it stays right here off the shoulder and I love it because it shows off the tattoos that I have anything that shows off my tattoos is a winner I've also worn this dress with no bra and it made it still made my me look good you can't tell that I don't have a bra on so I am just over the moon thrilled with this purchase um because it was just like on the whim type thing and I just got it and I don't even know what it says it says love means nothing I think and it ties up here the dryer sort of my dryer is like an a-hole and, and it hates me at least my old dryer so like it like tore off the thing but you can tie it up you can also loosen it and it has like this this like the words right here more so you can like loosen it up if you want if you have like bigger boobs or if you need more space so that was all the things that I got the first time around I didn't spend that much time there because I was with somebody and I hate going to the mall with people I like going by myself I like not feeling rushed I like to take my time so I uh, didn't get a lot of things however the second time around is the renter right here and I'm telling you guys for all of this I only paid $60 for all of this so let's get into this I got mainly bottoms again um I have a Charlotte Russe I'm not sure if I'm going to combine the Charlotte Russe haul with this haul because I do have some stuff from Charlotte Russe but I'm missing one thing and I'm trying to find it and I can't find it and I've been still moving out of my house in Chicago so I think it might be in Chicago so I might combine it I might not you guys probably know from the title so yeah but I got a lot of bottoms also bearing in mind that when I went to Charlotte Rose I actually got a lot of tops so you guys can think about that for later or if I'm gonna put it in the haul I'm thinking I might because then I can just combine the shirt and the top type of situation but I don't want to get too confusing so let's just get into what I got and this one I actually do have the receipt so yeah, literally, oh, I'm sorry. I literally paid $49.69 for that big bag of stuff. Yeah. Cause I, and then I got half off of everything. So, like, nothing is over $10. So, that's pretty, pretty cool if you ask me. Um, let's just get into it. The first thing I got were these pants. I started working at a job that requires to wear black pants. And I thought, let me just get some black pants. But I also got black pants for, like, going out. So these black pants are, like, more so for going out. If I want to wear them to work, I mean, I could. But I probably won't. And it's just this really, really cool pair of black pants that has these roses on them. It has this little detail here with the hoops. And at the bottoms, it has this new trendy, like, cut off where it cuts off here and it goes in the back here and it has hoops in the front also and these I got in a size 18 these were um eight dollars and 19 cents but I got half off of that so I paid like four dollars uh for these pair of pants and there's a little bit of stretch on here um they are a little snug so i feel like these fit like true to size so, so if you see these online or something similar to these because i did have a different pattern but it still had the roses going on online um just keep that in mind to get your true size but it does have a little bit of stretch so like if you have if you have bigger hips than me or whatever i'm pretty sure um see it's a little bit stretchy i'm pretty sure they could be able to fit into these and i just thought they were super cute i'm not the biggest fan of this whole like ankle thing not just in just not on these pants but like just in general but because i'm short you don't really see that and i wear high heels anyway so it's not like it's really going to matter but if you have some cool shoes i guess that could be like a cool thing to do i don't know and then i got oh i love this so i got so i saw this collection come out with Forever 21 a couple months ago and I was like eh, I'm not I don't like Forever 21's pricing but let me get the price of this skirt because I did take the tag off and I have worn it and this is the oh I also got sunglasses I, I don't remember that so let's see then a pant skirt okay I got the skirt it was six dollars for this skirt and this is when Forever 21 came out with that whole they came up with this whole line there was like a dress like this they came out with like a like a bandeau top like this with this whole like crisscross I don't know what it's called this whole like crisscross detailing and this is like smack dab in the middle of the dress this is the front of the dress and it's 
it's a midi dress so it comes like a little bit past your knees a little bit above your knees oh i'm sorry this is the front i'm sorry i had it upside down like this and it's again it has like this sort of curved out shape so again it gives you hips um you can wear this plenty of different ways now how i wear this is a little bit high waisted because i do like to wear my um what are they called my like crop tops my crop tops um and i like to wear like it with high-waisted things so when i wore this out i wore this high-waisted with a, that bandana crop top that i showed you guys in my charlotte my other charlotte Russe haul that you guys saw um but you could wear this a little bit lower and make it a longer skirt make it go to your ankles if um if you're not if you don't like your belly in you could wear this high enough to where it goes almost right below like your boobs and have it like like right above your knee there's a lot of different ways you can wear dress uh, skirts like these these long skirts and i really really like that because you can always switch it up um and that to me is just super super cool another pair of black pants here these are more so the black pants i was thinking about wearing to work because they are pretty plain jane i got these in a size 16 i paid four dollars and fifty cents for them uh originally they were on sale for nine dollars i don't know how much they were originally though it doesn't tell me but i got half of the on sale price and this one i'm not sure if you can see or not but it only just has this one little detail where it's like stitching here and then on the other side stitching here which you're not going to be able if you don't see it now you're not going to be able to see it on try on haul either but pretty much on all the just standard black pants a lot of lot of stretch so i will say that there, there are some people who are on the odd side of sizing meaning a lot of places carry the even number sizes like i'm an 18. if you're like a 17 i'm pretty sure you'll be able to fit into if you're a 17 i'm pretty sure you'll be able to fit into like a 16. Or if you're a 19, you'll be able to fit into an 18 type thing. Because there's a lot of stretch here. And they're pretty comfortable. This is the Forever 21 brand. And they're pretty standard length. So if you're like my... I'm 5'6". If you're like my height, these are going to look perfect on you. One shirt that I actually did get from there is this shirt. that I know, I know why it was on sale. Um, let me actually put my own and this is actually a shirt from the previous haul that i was missing because i bought this the previous time so i don't know how much it cost do know that it's cheap though and i think because i think it was on sale because it's supposed to be a tie right here and the tie was gone so i'm pretty sure that's why i just wear this with like um you know when they came out with those bras with like with like the spikes on them or like bejewels like like bustiers i like to wear this shirt with bustiers you can, however, obviously get a shoelace or a ribbon or something and tie this up. But I like it as an excuse to like sort of show off my fancy bras because I don't like wearing them by themselves. So this is how that looks there. And it's just like a motorcycle. And I'm pretty sure it says some words that nobody cares about. And, and it has a little choker detail on it. Now, a shirt that I actually got from this haul is this i'm pretty sure it's acdc no no it's not it's the who and it's actually a 1x i believe yeah it's a 1x and it fits me it fits me pretty well i might wear an undershirt i might not depending and it was nine dollars originally 19.90 i got a half off of nine so i paid four dollars and fifty cents for this shirt and what I really like about this is it has the cutoff thing, but then it has this open shoulder situation. And I'm pretty sure this is, a, this is another thing where they they probably had like a ribbon or something that broke. Because ten, when you have this kind of design here on shirts, is a tendency that they put them on there because they have that crisscross detail going on with some type of fabric. Um, which for me doesn't bother me at all because I actually like it open. And like I said, I could always just buy a shoelace or a ribbon and put that through here. And it just says the who and it's black. If you guys hadn't noticed, I bought a lot of black things. Um, and I just like it. Just It's like, it's just like a standard t-shirt with a little bit of flair. Sometimes when they do the, this design, but right here on the front, it kind of chokes me a little bit. Um, with this, I don't have that problem. And it just gives you a little bit of something extra. And then I got another pair of black pants. Surprise, surprise. Now this isn't from a Target, this isn't from a Forever 21 brand. This is the brand CeeLo. I'm not sure if you guys can see that or not. It's from the brand CeeLo, but it's still a size 18. But these did fit me kind of snug. So <coughs> I'd say if you have a little bit of loving on the bottom, size up or make sure you try it on in stores. 
this was <clears throat> originally $29. It was on sale for $12 and I got it for six because it was half off of the sale price. And these black pants just have, I might have to put my, I might have my hand in here for these. They just have that, that whole little rip distressed uh, design that's been going on. So this like hits me right at the knee. And then they have some right here at the ankle. And then also what I thought was really cool is behind the pant leg and the back. So if you're a taller girl, this is gonna really look really, really nice on you. We can pair this with some black stilettos and it's gonna look super, super bomb. Um, for me, you don't really see the ankle part, but for, like, again, I don't really, really care. Um, this is just something that I thought was cool. I know I needed more pants, so. Black pants are the easiest for me because I do change my hair a lot, as you guys have noticed, and colored it a lot. And black is just a lot easier to match when you're like in a hurry type of thing. And we have the last thing, and this is something that is not up my alley at all. It's not my style at all. However, I tried it on and I was just super, super obsessed with it. I have one little ripe, one thing that grinds my gears about this, and we'll get into that. This <coughs> is a Favorite 21 brand. It's a shirt. It was originally $24.90 on sale for $15, so I got it for like, what, $7.50? And it's like a crop top shirt. But for me, it's a little bit longer than crop top. I like my crop tops to sort of stop like right here. And for me, that one stops like a little bit down there. So it's okay. This is something that I might want to wear with, um, with a high-waisted situation. So what we have here is a swoop back with a bow. And I'm not sure if you guys can see that well or not. But it's like a tied little lace situation here. And then what, really, really, what I like the most about this is the sleeves. It's sort of that bell sleeve trend that we've been seeing go around, but it's like ruched and it's super, super cute. It's really, really flattering. If you have big arms, it's super flattering because what it does then is creates all the tension and drama and volume sort of from your forearm down and then it doesn't make your arm look as big um, compared to everything else. So if you do have big arms, you're going to love this. Actually, is this in the front? I don't, okay, I don't know where this thing goes. I think this is, I don't know where this tie goes to be honest with you because, because here's the back, here's where the tag is. So I don't know if it goes in the front. I can't remember when I tried it on. Maybe it does go in the front and swoop and then it has this arm. Now the only thing I don't like about this is the arms are really long. So if you're one of those girls that's, that has super long arms, like I watched this girl Patricia in the UK and she has super long arms. If you have super long arms, this is going to look great on you. For me, what ends up happening for me is this sleeve here is my hand ends up just getting lost in there and you, and you don't even see my fingertips in there. And that's the only issue I have with this. Um, but all in all, it's a pretty, pretty cute shirt. Just something different, you know, just trying to venture out and see what's out there and hop on some of these trends and get a little taste of something before they're over because we all know trends come and go. So yeah, that was all of the clothes that I got from Forever 21. I'd say all together with both with both uh, shopping trips that I did, I'm pretty sure I spent under $100. I'm pretty sure it was like 70 or 75. And that's a lot of clothes. So I know Forever 21 doesn't really do a lot of that online because the reason why they're clearancing things is because they, have, they had an overstock or they didn't have as much buyers as they anticipated. So they're giving you a discounted price to sort of make space and get rid of it so they can bring in a new shipment for like a new season. So I'd say if you're on a budget, go into stores, especially when it comes to plus size, Charlotte Russe and Forever 21, because they always have sales and sometimes they're really, really good sales, like the one that I just had. So we're gonna move on to try on portion.
watching my video I really, really appreciate it please bear with me while I'm trying to get my life together um hopefully by April we'll, we'll be on a set schedule and I'll be like uploading or whatever but right now I'm just trying to like get it together so I will see you guys in the next video love you bye